Hello there, I am Giant Girl with more Pokemon Ruby Redo. In the last part, we took on the uh, unseeable Pokemon, which turned out to be Kecleon. With the Devon we used the Devon Scouts to see them. We caught one, I think, and uh, we also fainted one for experience, and one also fled. The one in front of the gym that that was blocking the gym fled. Um, and we also took on the uh, Fortress City Pokemon Gym, we brought all the trainers in the gym, they weren't too hard, and then Wyona wasn't too hard because we ended up one-shotting all four of the Pokemon, mind, be, mind it be, with different Pokemon, of course, not one Pokemon, like totally swept it, swept their team, but yeah. So I th I have a uh, fire up front, so let's take on this cool trainer. I'm like 90% sure as I said in the last part, that this cool trainer has a Miletic, so watch out, this Miletic will be hard. Um, yeah, at least in my experience it has been. Pokemon have many special abilities. If you want to become first class, if you first become a first class trainer, learn all about them. That's good to know, and it's true actually. This is a uh, cool trainer, Jennifer. Yeah, she has a mile tick. Okay, it's level thirty-one. Okay, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta do good. So I'm gonna try out with just using a facade first. So let's get his water pulse on fire. Too, okay. We have one level higher than it, but it already did one third of its of fighter's max HP and a confused fighter. Yeah, oh man, this is bad. And that only did about a third of, well, not even a third, maybe like a fourth of. Oh gosh, this is not a good situation. Let's use a let's use a yellow food to heal uh, fighter's confusion, snap it out confusion, and then she's gonna oh it's gonna use water pulse again because water pulse does have a chance to confuse your opponent so. Critical hit, wow. Oh, poor fighter got clobbered there. Jeez, the smile tick is no joke. I'm serious. The smile tick is serious business. Let's go to Geico then, and uh, we'll, we'll just leaf blade this thing while with the type advantage. So that's good. Let's go for the leaf blade. And let's see what this does. Okay, it does. Puts in the red health. She's probably, she's probably gonna, okay, that, okay, recover. Or she's always gonna use healing item. So let's go for, let's weaken down just a little bit more and then use Leaf Blade again so that way it doesn't go in the red, red health zone. So let's try a quick attack. Okay, that barely did. Okay, we'll have to try like another quick attack and then a Leaf Blade. Another Leaf Blade. Water Pulse is, oh my gosh, they did like a fourth of damage, fourth of Geico's max HP. And it's, it was this, you know, water type moves like Water Pulse. Jeez. Now let's get, and the thing is that it has recovered too. This is an annoying Pokemon, honestly. Like after this battle, I want to just heal up my Pokemon, go back to Fortress and heal my Pokemon up. Cause the fighter already fainted, you know? So Smile Tech is no joke. You take it very seriously, don't underestimate it. Yeah, it's serious business, guys and gals. Okay, yeah. Okay, hopefully one more Leaf Blade will finish it off. And Water Pulse also gets a boost because it's raining outside. So Water Time moves are powered up a little bit. So it doesn't help our case. Luckily, we took out the mile tick. Should we go? Uh, yeah, we got over fourteen hundred experience. Fourteen, four thousand, one thousand four hundred fourteen experience to be exact. You obviously thinking. Thanks. Thanks for one thousand four hundred eighty-eight pocket dollars. I'm gonna go back to the Pokemon Center and Fortree and Seal. I'm gonna fly there with Screamo. Yeah. So I'll see you guys back here in a second. Okay, right back here if we use cut, but I don't have cut. Jeez, I think we get some berries, but yeah, if I just saw their fighter, it's still level 32. So, yeah. Is there a hand over here? Yeah, there is. Awesome. It's a zinc. Nice. I forget what that raises, though. It's a vitamin. I know that. Um, it raises a special defense of a Pokemon. So, let's use it on, uh, let's use it on Metroid, I guess. Yeah, Metroid special defense for us. Cool. Here's a picnicker. I think if you ride your bicycle, you actually make sure you stay in the line where there's just no tall grass, but like no cornfield grass. Yeah, if you're not fit, you can have rough time for in critical situations. I think I missed skip through your first paradox. I'm sorry. This is oh, it's Pokemon Ranger. Of course it is. It's Pokemon Ranger Jenna. So you send out Lotad. Cool. That's great. It is raining. Of course it is. And we'll use a uh, facade on this. Uh, Lotad. It's gonna use this Lotad's gonna use a Bazaar Bond uh, on Fighter, but it only does six HP, so that's good for us. And there goes Lotad, one hit, awesome. And a Wombray, okay, we'll stay in with a uh, Fighter. Wombray is level twenty nine and female, cool. Let's go for a facade. It's gonna use Fake Out on 
fighter, of course, to get a free hit. That's cool. I don't really like this Zomb right now. Just fight. Just faint it, man. Just faint it. So this Zomb also uses Absorb. And it only did it only did HP to fight it, so that's not too bad. So facade hit, and it almost went to kills it. That's a bummer. Let's go finish it with a rock tube. Hopefully, I'll get another four star, of course. Whatever. Rock tube. Hit. Oh my gosh, I should have gone with arm thrust. Because rock tube doesn't have the best accuracy. Get swift nature power turn into swift, of course. Okay, yeah. Now I can probably finish it off with the facade. So the rain continues to fall, we know, we know. A oh, few swipes, jeez. The swamper is very annoying. And it should take it out, it does. Awesome critical, I'll take it. Nice. So far to good level of 33, it's already has 144 HP, smelling salt. I don't want to sell, I don't want to teach smelling salt to um, fighter. Sorry. Yeah. So what does Nuzleaf? Okay. We'll stay in, I guess, because Nuzleaf has half dark type and dark type Pokemon are weak against fighting type moves. So that's good for us. Let's go for the arm thrust. This Nuzleaf is level 29 and female. Okay, cool. Nice, okay. We defeated Pokemon Ranger Jenna. I'm totally fit, but thanks for the 1392 Pocket Always, man. We appreciate it. Something unseeable is in the way. Yeah, okay, cool. Let's use the one scope. Yeah, you're gonna attack or you're gonna. Yeah, you're gonna attack. Okay, fine. We'll find this Kekleon for experience because we already call him for a Pokedex anyway. Cool. This Kekleon is level 30 in male. Cool. Nice. I know what I can do. I can uh, put, use Rock to make it a Rock type Pokemon. Of course, you Rock to miss. Of course. Hi, hi, hi. Rock to has terrible accuracy or something. Cause I, I forget. I'm gonna look up the accuracy after this battle. Cause it's like annoying how much it's uh, missing. So now the Kick Land's a Ground type, or not Ground type, but Rock type. So that means um, any. That it's a rock type and uh, it's fighting type moves are super effective. Even though it's already f super effective, fighting type moves are already super effective when it's still normal type. But yeah. Let's go for the arm thrust. Let's see. This should take it out. Awesome. And it, oh man, I'll get hit three times. Good. Nice. Okay. That's awesome. Cool. I'm gonna hop on my wrist so I don't accidentally go on the tall grass. Okay, this is this. I think this is the camp, or it could be a Pokemon Ranger. I'm check. I'll check if your Pokemon. I'll check your Pokemon and see if they are fit for the outdoors. All of them are, of course. That's being judgmental and picky and pushy, I guess. Uh, this is Pokemon Ranger, of course. It's Carlos, yeah. Pokemon Ranger Carlos. Cool. So let's go for a facade on the Sea Dot. The Sea Dot's level 29 and feet male, so that's pretty cool. Facade hits, awesome. Oh man, I almost want to kiss it. Dang it. Oh well. We'll use um an arm thrust on it then. As a to hopefully finish it off. Yeah, okay, of course you can use a force door. You're just afraid that you see that's gonna faint, which it would have. Jeez. Okay, I might as well just use another arm thrust then. Rain can you just fall? Yes we know it's raining outside. We're not dumb, even though they didn't say we're dumb, so yeah, whatever. Okay, the sea dot goes down, awesome. Carlos about to say Mwambre out, okay, cool. Pokemon, Trainer, Pokemon Ranger Carlos, okay, cool. Let's go for the Vital Thrill. Of course, I'm gonna just fake out to get free it. That's what I usually did when I still in my heart, I might still have to fake out on it. Yeah. Let's go for the Vital Thrill. Nature Power turned into Swift, of course it did. Ay ay ay. So let's see how much this Vital Thrill does. Oh yeah, when he kills it, awesome. Nuzleaf, okay. We'll actually use, I think we can just use an Arm, with, arm Thrust on Nuzleaf. Because again, Nuzleaf is weak against Fighting Timers because it's half Dark type. So yeah. 
Fake out, oh my goodness. Jeez, again, free hits everywhere. It's not as if it's level 29 and fe male. I must have female there. Huh. There we go, awesome. There we go, nice. Spider good level 34, awesome. We defeat Pokemon Ranger Carlos. With Pokemon that strong, you're in no danger of needing rescue. Thanks. Thanks for 1,392 uh, Pokedollars, dollars, man. There's an item down there, as you saw right there. Or you may have saw it. I kind of wrote past it because I went off screen or went away from it. So let's put Geico up front, I guess. So half my Pokemon on level 34, half my Pokemon on level 33. That's good to know. Here's an item. It's a nugget. Awesome. Very worth picking up. We can sell that Pokemon for 5,000 Poké Dollars. Awesome. Here's another bush to make a secret base. The van will shortly stop here soon, so that's good. So yeah, I'm here. I guess not, but it looks like there'd be one. Oh well. I'm gonna hop on my bicycle. <laughs> See, the rain stopped now. It's all sunny again. Yay! Uh, yeah, we can hop over that way just to go back, or backtrack over there and go back around if we wanted to, but that would be silly. There's another, there's an item actually right there, but yeah, see right there? On the bottom of the screen? Right there? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, it's, oh, this is just the instance level for basic basis. Shoot. Okay. So I thought there was an item over here, but I guess not. Oh my goodness. That was a Meryl level 23, by the way. And I didn't mean to fast forward there, sorry. <laughs> Here's a bug maniac. He probably has a so skid if I were to guess. Wait, want to battle? Yeah, sure we would. I would like to battle. Nice. Okay, so a bug maniac Brandon. So that's so skid I was right, cool. So I think it'd be neutrally effective if we use Leap Wade, so I guess we could use it. Um, let's see how much it does. So skid's level 28 in male. So let's see how much this Leap Wade does. One of is it awesome? Nice. Yeah, but uh, he, has an, he has another Sir so Skid. He, he might have three Sir so Wow. So Skid in the wild, like you can you can find one at the route west of a uh, of Old Deal Town, but it's like one percent chance of appearing. So like I ran into one once, but then but I didn't catch it. So like I've only ran into one once in the wild, really. When playing through these, playing Ruby Sapphire, I never would really. He has three Sir so Wow. Interesting. So, they're all gonna have the same fate though with the Leaf Blade. There we go, nice. Now I got Kiss level 34, awesome. Pokemon, we defeated Bug, Catcher, Bug Maniac Brandon. I lost. Thanks for $1,680. Don't be too hard on yourself, man. You did. You put up a good fight, kinda not really. I'm just kidding. Well, I'm not actually kidding. I'm being blunt. Okay, so I'm gonna go to switch to Smokey, I guess. Take this item, which is a Hyper Potion, very worth picking up. It stores 200 HP of one Pokemon. And, uh, if he, I think she gives us a berry or something. Give it, give the case a shake and out pops a Pokeblock. And that Pokeblock is caught and eaten by a Pokemon. If it's an expression of love, isn't it? Yes, 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 I understand what you mean. You should take this. We can aggrove uh, berry, whatever I pronounce that name, berry name. I think the berry is rare. I hope you raise it with love and care. It'll stay rotting in my berry pouch or whatever. Berry's pocket in my backpack, if that's what you mean. Not really. That's not what you mean. She wants me to actually take care of it, but I'm not going to. Well, it's going to just stay in my backpack, you know, not be used. <laughs> that's kind of, kind of really mean to say, but it's kind of true at the same time. So we get six Petra Berries from here, that's awesome. The Petra Berries again heal poison, so that's really cool. And we can go up these stairs. And look at all these different berries right here. We got repair we got repair berries. And then we got pineapple berries is next. I forget what the berry to the right of the pineapple berries are, but the last one should be a cherry berry cherry berries. This is a nut nut berry cool. And then I think this is a cherry berry, last one. Let's see if I'm right. Oh, raspberries. The raspberries and cherry berry kind of look the same in my opinion. Yeah, nice. Okay, so let's use Surf, but I'm also going to use a Repel. So let's uh, use a Repel. 
We have 24 super balls after this. Cool. I think you can find a rare candy or something here. I didn't mean to surf right there. We got a rare candy. Awesome. So now we have 12 rare candies. And a full heal. Awesome. Nice. Oh, he's a ninja boy. So let's go to um, our bag, yeah, and see how many rare candies we have. We have 12 rare candies now, so I could uh, I could raise all my Pokemon at least twice. Uh, so that's awesome. Let's take on this ninja boy. I will adopt I would I will adopt the movements of Pokemon and create new technique new ninja techniques. That's kind of cool to do if you're into that kind of stuff. So this is ninja boy Kaigo, I guess is how I pronounce the name. I could be wrong. Let's go for the flame throw on this uh, coughing. It's level it's level twenty nine with the email to email, so that's pretty cool. One AK, awesome. Yeah, Ninjask is next. Let's stay in. Ninjask is gonna be weak to um flame thrower, so that's awesome. Oh, it's gonna use double team. Of course it is. Come on, Smokey, you can find the right one. There we go. Still, it's awesome. This Ninjask is level twenty nine male. If I didn't already say that. There goes the ninjask. Nice. What do you fear, Ninja Boy Kaigo? Um, the creation of a new ninja technique is but a distant dream. Sorry, man. Don't feel too bad about yourself. You'll get it. Thanks for 348 pocket dollars, man. And here's a ruined maniac, I believe. Who might you be? Aren't you perhaps searching for ancient ruins that to possibly exist according to legend? Yeah, this is where you can find Reggie Steel, but we have to unlock the Reggies, like I said before, to get to him. But we'll get that later, I guess. So yeah. Okay, so he's a Sentry level 28. Let's see how much uh, Flamethrower will do, just out of curiosity. Sentry's level 28 in male. Oh, it's gonna use Poison Sting on Smoke AGs. Okay, I'll just eat poison smoky. There we go, awesome when I kill. Okay, smoky's another level four, awesome. Let me make us about to sentry. Okay, we'll switch to a uh, screamer, I guess. Screamer is the last Pokemon I have that's still level thirty-three. This sentry's level twenty-eight, male. Okay, cool. And can you just fall? That's great. Let's go for the airways. One more arrow should, should do it. Now the okay, so the um, Sentry it won't affect um, you know, Scream won't be affected by the dig because you know it's half flying types. Let's go up in the air, and uh, the Sentry is gonna be back up in the ground. There we go, nice. And uh, yeah, dig. I mean not dig, but fly. Yeah, Scream will use fly. Awesome. Oh, there's a sand slash too. Course. I'm gonna try stealing. The uh, screamer's gonna try stealing and see how much of that does. Sentry's level. This sense slash is level 28 in male. So that's cool. Okay, yeah. Slash doesn't do too much. I think, yeah, stealing did at least one third of uh, sense slash's max HP. So that's good for us. Yeah, one more, one more stealing should do it. Let's get a slash again. Yeah, it's not gonna be very effective though. Sorry. So wait, one more stealing should take this thing out. Let's see if I'm right. Awesome, I'm right. Nice. We defeated Moon Maniac Chip. Okay, what a disgraceful setback. I'm sorry. Thanks for the 3,360 pocket dollars though. Is there any item back here or something? I guess not. Maybe if you use item finder, you could probably find an item, but I don't know for sure. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna put Scream up to the front. Yeah, there we go, nice. Let's keep on trucking. There's another bush to put to make a secret base, since so that's cool. Uh, route 121 is here, Route 120 is to the left. Okay, so Route 121 is to the right, and Route 120 is to the left, is what I should have said first. Here's Route 121. So here is, uh, I think, uh, not really. Not, I think she has ghost type Pokemon, but I forget the trainer type name. The power is beyond our understanding in the world. So I think she has like a, maybe Duskull and a Shepherd or something, or 
something like that. Ghost type Pokemon. Hex Maniac. Oh. <clears throat> a Hex Maniac. Okay, that makes sense. Let's go for the Air Cutter. This Ross is level 30 in male and female, I should say. Yeah, and it goes down one hit. Awesome. But I think she would have Ghost Pokemon, but I guess. Yeah, she does have Ghost Pokemon. She just had a weird sec uh, Waltz is a second Pokemon. So there's a Duskull and a Waltz. So she's pretty easy to defeat. Let's go for another Air Cutter. It missed, okay. Fine, we'll just go, um. We'll use a Air Ace, which, never, which shouldn't miss in this situation. So yeah, let's use Air Ace. So this Duskull is level 30 and female. So that's pretty cool. It's not very effective. Astonish isn't very effective. That's good for us. And yeah, this Duskull should go down it. It does. Awesome. We defeated Hex Maniac Tammy. I have lost. I'm sorry. Thanks for 1,440 Pokemon dollars, though. You seem really nice. Here's some more berries right here. Here's some two pairs of berries. I think the third, the third one is a uh, Ross berries. I think those the last ones are Chester berries. These are Asper berries. Two Asper, two Asper berries. So that's pretty cool. Nice. Uh, yeah, two Ross berries, which heal Baron, which is nice. That's always good to have. And two Chester berries. They heal sleep. So that's awesome. Also good to have. Is there an item over here? Maybe hit an item. Wait, do I have a pull up still? Oh, an HP up. Nice. I'm gonna make sure I have a pull up real quick. Oh, yeah, still have a pull up. Cool. Just making sure. No, oh, of course it runs out there. Let's put another pull up. So, let's see here. Wait, who has the lowest HP out of my party right now? Let's see, um, let's go through the list, actually. So, uh, Skarmory has 95 HP. Uh, Sorkle has 101 HP. Uh, Grovi, uh, Grovi has, um, 90 HP. Uh, Karm has 148, well, 108 for, um, Grumpig. And 107 for, uh, Tentacle. So I'm pretty sure Grovile has the least amount of HP. So I'm gonna give the HP up to Grovile. Hopefully it raises HP, actually, that'd be nice. Yeah, because HP raised it. Raised really, or is it just saying that and lying to my face? Yeah, it raised one HP because it, it was at 90 HP, now it's at 91. So that's cool. So uh, that's good. Here is, I forget what Trinity is. I think you're a beauty. Stop, I have, I look at my precious Pokemon. This is a beauty, and I don't know what Pokemon she has off the top of my head, so we're going to have to see. And Beauty Jessica would like to battle. She has a Kecleon. Of course she has a Kecleon. Okay, let's use um, Aerial Ace on this thing. No, I'm going to use Aerial Ace, but whatever. Air Cutter still hits. Awesome. Coaching change to Flying type. Okay, cool. Yeah, Fury, Fury Swipes. That's great. Yeah, I don't hit twice. That's good. Let's go for the Aerial Ace this time. Dang it. She might use a full store or something. You know, you never know. Okay, Fury Swipes again. It's only going to hit twice. Good for us. It's because in the oh, early she didn't heal, that's good. I'm glad she didn't. Okay, she's about to use Survivor. Okay, so, yeah, Survivor trying to use poison type moves on Skarmory won't work because Steel is immune to poison, so that's awesome. Let's go for the Steel Wing. This Survivor is level 30 and female. Ooh, I did a little bit, I have, cool. Let's get a Screech on Skarmory, okay. This defense is harsh with fell. That's not good. But we'll knock out the swiper anyway. Hopefully this knocks it out. It does. Awesome. Yeah, screaming good love thing for awesome. We defeated Beauty Jessica. Oh how dare you? Don't take it so seriously. I'm sorry, I'm pretty I'm playing pretty casually, honestly. Thanks for forty eight hundred poke dollars. Uh okay, move okay, we're well, to move out to Mount Pyre. Okay. We'll have to follow you there eventually, I guess. I think there's like an incident on the wall again for a secret base, or there's an item. So, uh, let's put, um, let's put Geico up front, I guess. Are you a trainer? Uh, Ahead Looms Mount Pyre. It's a natural monument to the spirits of departed Pokemon. Nice. Okay, who's in my second slot for this double battle? Uh, Smokey, I guess. We can go fire and uh, grass type combo. Um, together with few of us, we de will demonstrate how tough we are. Okay. That's cool. So 
So this is Senior and Junior Kate and Joy. Nice. Okay, Slacking and uh, Spinda. We probably want to take out the Slacking first. Let's use Leaf Blade on Slacking and Overheat on Slacking. Okay, Slack off, but it's HP is full. Good. Too bad, so sad. So the Spinda is level 30 in male and the Slacking is level 32 in male. So that's pretty cool. So Cybermon, Smokey, fine. Overheat, it's awesome. It's a slacking, nice. At one AKO, oh, oh, we didn't want. Well, we can't, we made it technically in one turn, but not one AKO. Yeah. Let's go for another Leaf Blade and a Body Slam. The Spinda is again in level 30 and it's male. Cool. Teeter Dance. What does that do again? Oh, it confuses Geico, of course. And it confuses Smokey. That's just great. Well, we can use a well, we can use a ill fruit, I guess. But anyway, the battle's pretty much over. I think yeah, now it's over. So that's good. We defeated the senior and junior with Kate and Joy. Please forgive us, Kate. Please forgive Kate. Me, Kate. I think that's what you said. Thanks for one thousand two hundred twenty-four poker dollars. This is, this is what I can use. Yeah, we can use another secret base tree thing. We can build a secret base. Here's the here's um the Fasari bone. Fasari bone. No Fasari zone. There we go. There's actually a trick where we we're, we're no we're not really close to Pokemon Center, but I'll show you a trick. Is if you put your Pokemon on the PC, they actually restore their HP and PP. So uh, let me put Twitch in the. P let me have Twitch. I don't think Twitch got hurt at all really and used any PP, right? 20, 15, 10, 20. Yeah, Twitch is still perfectly healed, so I'm gonna put everyone else in the PC, and magically, with them being put in the C, they'll be fully healed with PP and HP restored completely. So that's awesome. It's a little cool trick I learned, and it's pretty obvious too, because like whenever you get, five, when you already have six Pokemon, and you're, you catch a new Pokemon that goes to the PC, that's how, that's why it's always healed. Except fucking like the first generation games, they weren't always healed when they went to the PC. So I guess that's kind of a bummer. So, uh, actually we can just deposit them all the way, except for us, Twitch. So let's do that. Deposit, 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 and deposit. And we can all withdraw them too, nice. So yeah. Withdraw. 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 And withdraw. Nice. Yeah, this fight, the Fitzalvia Zone we'll cover later. I don't really feel like covering it right now, but I'll cover it later. Um, hopefully soon though. So let's see here. Um, everyone's level 34 really, so that's awesome. So Twitch is at front, I guess. That's cool. Uh, I think we have time for one more battle, so let me do one more battle. Uh, it, we'll do this Genome one. I think he has a main metric though, so how do I want to go about this? I'll have Twitch go up, up front. We can finally use Twitch's Psychic type move that went back at level 34. Oh, uh, back at the, yeah, back. Uh, oh, it still has, oh wait, is it, we haven't trained this switch in a long time because we made sure it evolved and it was ahead by two levels for a good two ups, two parts or so. So yeah, with my Pokemon I have traveled the four, four corners. Uh, you might say I have some confidence in my abilities. That's, that's good to know though. It's good to know that you're confident. So yeah. Here is Gentleman Walter, nice. He's a main net trick. Okay, let's use, um, this is our new move Psychic that Twitch learned, or Twitch's new move Psychic. This man just level 31. Oh man, awesome. It's always special defense, but it's in the red health. So it might heal its main trick, but that's okay. It's all good. Let's go for the Psybeam to finish it off, hopefully. Let's see if it does. And it does, awesome. Yeah, Twitch good level 35, awesome. Nice. We defeated Gentleman Walter. Ah, uh, well played. Thanks. Thanks for 2,480 poker dollars. I really appreciate it, man. Do we, do we still have a super pull up? I'm kind of nervous if we don't. Or, we have plenty of super pull ups, but still. Okay, that one still lingers from before. Okay, cool. Let's grab this item. Yeah, one Carbos. Cool. I think we might want to cover the Safari Zone in the next part, actually, since we're, since we're still out here. Oh man, I said that that will be the last part of the video. You, I accidentally stepped in front of you. Would you like to play with my dollar for a pretty Pokemon? Okay, I think uh, I think Twitch is still up front, but that kind of stinks, but 
I don't know. Yeah, Pikachu. Okay, come on, Twitch, you can do this. Let's just psych on this thing. This Pikachu's level 31 and female. So yeah, this is probably this is definitely the last battle of the video now, because I actually ran into this Pokemon battle. Okay, whatever. We defeated Poker Fan Vanessa. Uh, this isn't what I meant. Sorry, I don't even read your dialogue really, I'm sorry. Next for 2400 eight Poker Dollars though. So yeah, um, I'm gonna stay right here so I don't accidentally run in front of any other trainers that want to battle. <laughs> Honestly, let's put fight up to the front, I guess. So yeah, in the next part, we'll take on the Safari Zone and uh, check it out. I mean, I, 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 I'm checking out the Safari Zone in the next part because I'd say I'd do it soon. I guess while I'm still here, I might as well just do it. And I think I can get like a cool TM if I remember, if my memory serves me correctly. So yeah, so in the next part, we'll do the Safari Zone and uh, probably get to Lolico City too. So yeah, so this has been Jacko again. I would like to thank you for by, and I'll see you guys next part. My Pokemon would be Redo Walkthrough Guide.